Well, good morning, my YouTube friends. I'm in the grow room. Uh, the humidifier is on. Um, and we'll, I'm going to go downstairs in a minute to have a cup of tea. And I just thought, well, I'll put the uh, the mounts back that I've watered this morning. And um, I also looked above me and uh, on that webbed um, basket we've got on the wall. Um, I thought, oh, I'll just pull the big fell down. And I've pulled that down. I'll show you that in a minute. And then I thought, well, that uh, Dendrobium friedrianum um, still looked as though she was rotting. And she's had a Q-tip down. Let me just show you inside here. I have to be careful because she's quite a big plant. You see in there now. Now that's quite clean. And the only reason it's clean is because I've had this Q-tip right up inside her. See how far down it goes? And uh, I've used that Q-tip there. I've got all that gunge out and now I've got this um, cinnamon powder. And She's going to have that now, inserted. There we go. Pushed and inserted in there. I can't uh, take the risk. Let's have a look. Let me just blow it. I might just have to put a little bit more in there now. She's just angled a bit awkward this one because it's because it's in that basket and you know what it's like when you've got cinnamon powder. It never wants to go where you want it to go. Let's see if I can guess because I'm trying to see what I'm doing and, and keep you in focus as well. Now, now that other leaf's gone in the way now. Let's have a look see if I can do it this way. Let me just change hands and see how far down that cinnamon powder's gone. Can you see down there now? I think it's gone right down and touched the bottom now. And uh, see that was that's how far down it had gone, it had rotted to there. Well you must if you ever see an orchid that's, for whatever reason, got some rotting issues, it won't go away. You've got to, just just checking the back of the leaf because I've got some power on, you've got to deal with it. And I got the tweezers there and like I say, I've pull, I pulled, I pulled this leaf out, I had to pick all that gunge out there with the with the tweezers there and um, there was the other part of the leaf uh, and then I've um, used the q-tips and uh, I think she'd be alright now but I will keep my eye on her in fact um, when I've finished videoing and I've had my cup of tea I will, let before I anger back up there I will make sure that um, this rot, because what you don't want is of course this rot to travel down that cane. Can't be doing with that. Got to act now. Anyway, there's that other, that one, not the other one. That, that, that's the only little um, spike I've got coming on that one. Let me just check if all these other leaves are fine. Let me just have a look. There's going to be no issue with them. So. I'm going to just rest her over there now and uh, it's like major surgery in here this morning, goodness gracious. And the other good news is I, I was, um, I pulled this fowl down here, this is the one that um, just hangs up and I've had this since 2015 and like, look at that, 
excitement, excitement. I can't tell you how excited I am. February 2015, so I've had this. I think it was 15, 16. Yeah, it's 15. And it was 99p this off eBay. And uh, I can't believe after all this time it's deciding to give me a, a flower, a spike. See, it's, just, it's ready for watering this and I water and feed it now. And then that's where it sits, right up there. Sorry about that. So I've got the uh, dendrobium there, that's a little bit sick. And I've got this one, that was terribly sick when it came to me. And I've no idea, it's a no idea, well I don't, I've no idea what it is. It, it, it was just something somebody was getting rid of and um, I did have a, um, not Gongora, what was the other one? Hmm, it's the one that comes with the big uh, flower beneath the pot and um, that died. But I persevered with this one and uh, it's going to reward me. So just a very quick video this morning, uh, one to show the uh, the new uh, bud that's forming on this no ID and the other one to just make you aware that if you've got any rotting issues at all don't sit there and ignore, well if you, you'll ignore at your peril, you've got to look at it, check it and perhaps see what's causing it. Now I suspected it was that water running down the canes and it didn't actually completely run out which then caused the rotting issue and uh, let's have a look we're here and it's 22 and it's 73 percent humidity so I'll love you and leave you now and um, thanks for joining me take care bye for now